Why do we bother wearing a mask if our cabin is pressurized in a fighter jet? This is Motor Walsh. I flew F-16s in the Air Force for 20 years, and now I make videos explaining them to you. When you fly in a fighter jet, you wear a mask and a helmet just like this one, right? This was mine from flying the F-16, okay? The mask clips on and you breathe oxygen through the hose. Now, the F-16 cockpit is in fact pressurized. It goes on a pressurization schedule where when you climb your first couple thousand feet, you're the same as the outside pressure. And then above a set altitude, it begins pressurizing the cockpit. So as you climb, it remains comfortable for the human body. So you can actually breathe in the cockpit. You can drop your mask and breathe just fine at any time that you're flying F-16. So why do we wear the mask? Well, also inside this helmet, there is a bladder on the inside, right up here on the back of your head. It inflates and pushes forward. And what that does is it squeezes the mask into your face when you're under high G loads. So when you're pulling a lot of Gs in the F-16, what it tends to happen is the mask will slip down on your face like that and you get uh, gaps in the mask, right? Because the G is pulling down on the mask while pushing back on your body. So in order to keep the mask tight against your face and to keep the pure oxygen going into your lungs, the bladder inflates, pressing your face into the mask. It also increases the volume of air going in so that it is easier to breathe under G. I've shown you in other videos the technique for G straining and how you properly breathe and strain your body against the Gs. Well, the helmet and all the gear that you wear enables you to pull more G, stay conscious, perform all your tasks while doing it. Additionally, if you ever have a rapid decompression, you lose pressurization and you're at a high altitude, the mask is gonna protect you against any sort of a hypoxic symptoms or a hypoxia situation if you have the mask on. So that's what we wear, that's why we wear it. Watch out for the scam accounts. Real Sean Walsh is my only account, I don't have any other ones. So if you're seeing other accounts where people are asking you for information or they're reposting my videos, that is not me. So watch out for them and report them. Stay safe.